Right, welcome back to Mobile Suit Gundam Side Stories with Lost War Chronicles and the Federation Side Story. Hopefully. <laughs> Again. Is she, did we see this, see this be a last time, so I don't think we're gonna go over it again. So let's just get into the mission. Something about an HLV. That looks like a... Dob... Dabude? Do... Do... Not, I don't remember. Let's add some. Things being said. Something won. Okay. Well, here we go then. I like how Matt Healy is sort of the, uh. Aside from Shiro Armada. Armada? Amada, whatever. Aside from Shiro, he's kind of the poster boy for the, uh. Ground-type Gundam. Although Shiro, Shiro is less the poster boy of the ground-type Gundam and more so of the Easy 8 But I like Matt Healy because he sticks to the ground-type Gundam, never really gets any upgrades throughout his time during the war. And so he's more known for utilizing the ground-type Gundam than most other Gundam pilots, at least within the Japanese media. <laughs> ダブルを中核とする公園の舞台が進路上に展開中です。こいつらの排除が先か。やれるのか。いつになく消極的じゃないか。なに、俺たちならやれるさ。ああ、俺たちならやれる。行くぞ。Conversely, however, I I feel like Matt Healy has less. Well, maybe not less, but no known particular justification for his particular attitude on why he doesn't want to kill enemy mobile suit pilots or anyone during during a war. With Shiro, I could understand because he fell in love with Aina Sahalian, who was a female Xeon test pilot he had an encounter with. Right, but I don't really care for the love story. But at least it explained his change in attitude as a pilot. Matt Healy sort of has this attitude from the beginning. And I don't know if they ever go into justifying exactly how and why he got to this point and why he's so adamant about it. Even after losing... Even after losing uh, Larry... Was it Anish or Larry? Well, that guy who was supposed to die in the uh, GM Sniper 2, who ultimately didn't in this version of the game, he maintained, uh, so Matt ended up maintaining his sort of thing about not killing enemy pilots, even after his death at the hands of that out-of-control Zaku pilot. Meanwhile, Ken Biederstadt sort of went on a ram vengeance rampage after one of his, after, uh, I think it was the female operator on the Xeon side ended up dead. I don't remember their names. Alright, this is where the mission kind of gets a little bit too freaking difficult for its own good. Because this is... Ace is high. I see you coming at me with that sword out. No, thank you. Oh god, leave me alone, Jesus! Balls! <laughs> Gangbang! 
Gangbang on the ground, Gundam! Look, guys, I know I'm sexy and hot and all that stuff, but let's, but let's be reasonable here! Holy shit! Get away! Holy smokes, come on! I saw that. Come here! Let me put this sword in a place where it's more appropriate. Your ass! Oh no you don't! Back off! No, 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 no! You! Not me! You! down a bit. Okay, you're supposed to be dead. Stay dead. Now, I, I kind of wish the punch shield was involved a little bit in this guy's melee combo, but I suppose there's no guarantees that the shield is always going to be attached to his arm at this point. It might have gotten blown off during combat. But whatever. Now this cutscene again, which I really don't understand, but... <笑><笑><笑> さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、
A lot of minor changes altogether, but still enough for me to say, hey, how come there's not a model kit of this variation? Hmm? Granted, I think there's a premium Bandai exclusive Gato's Gelgu that has that very beam rifle, and I think you can get the beam rifle itself on its own a certain standalone kit somewhere. But the shield and backpack, no, not so much. You have to uh, custom build both of those. So, hopefully I can fit this last mission to the rest of the video. It should be short one way or the other. At least short enough. Uh, because it's basically just a one-on-one -on -one duel between the Gundam and Gelgu ground types. うん。隊長、新たな敵部隊が接近中。モビルスーツ 3機 こちらは地球連邦軍第三独立機械化混成部隊マッツヒーリー注意俺は無駄な戦いを望まない武装解除の上投稿してくれジオン広告軍特別自由兵部隊モビルスーツ特務遊撃隊剣ビーダーシュタ
this should be enough, hopefully. Is it? There. ケンを収めてくれ。次の一撃。もう手加減はできない。それでいい。お前の全力を覚悟を見せてみろ。隊長、平成命令です。戦争は終わったんです。お前、最初から止めようとしていたな。無駄な血は流さないって言っただろう。本当に甘い。俺の戦う理由は仲間と空に帰還することだ。ザビ家の独裁が終わった今、人質となっていた家族の安全は確保された。これより我々は武装解除し、投降する。そうか。時間は必要かもしれないが、必ず君らを故郷